Any kids in here? Hey, are you a kid? <laughs> Whoa! Whoa! Cool. Hey, whoa! Are you the same guy? <laughs> I gotta get out of here! Did I eat shrooms? I'm out of here. Hey, go to school. What's up, bitch? Oh! Which one is... Wait a minute. Oh! Saved by the bell! Zero damage? Oh! Whoa! What the fuck? What kind of tracking is on that hell sweep? Oh! That guy was not even aiming at me with that punch. What's up, amigo? Why don't you get a little closer? Oh, he jumped out? Uh-oh. I can't hit him. Can I hit him? Uh-oh. What the fuck? Where is this guy? Oh, hi, D! Oh, I fired it! Oh, I got scared! How did that happen? How did that happen? Was that a different helicopter? I mean, what are you doing, my friend? Shut up. Don't tell me how to drive. Take cover before he shoots the laser. Use your abilities when the bars fill up. Dude, I think I know what I'm doing. <laughs> Bro Is this the wrong way? I think this is the right way I can't see him I've lost sight of the target Oh, oh, run for it He's stuck Oh, he's not stuck What do I do? Stand my ground Stand my ground Ah! Fuck I gotta lose him. Let's get him stuck on the pole. Idiot got stuck. Get him stuck on the bench. Get stuck on the bench. Get stuck on the tree. Nice. Ah, fuck! Oh, he got me! I'm on a sneaking mission with a fucking car. That was so sick. Uh, so then, what can I get you? Her eyes are red. I'm still waiting on it. Hey, you really think her tits are too small? I think you got a problem. They're abnormally big. <laughs> They're big. You know what they really should have done? All joking aside, what they should have done is they should have taken Resident Evil 3, the original game from PlayStation, and they should have just cut it into sections and sold it in an episodic format. That way, you could really piss off the fan base. Okay, I get it. By letting me breathe. I love. Depends. <laughs> Mind coming over tomorrow Thank night? you. My roommates should all be out for a while. Woo! Are you seriously that desperate? Just let go already. I... Only if you promise to come back tomorrow night. Deal? Yeah. What? <laughs> no promises are not happening. <laughs> Trust me, it's like the most important shit. Like, don't buy more shit until you've paid it <laughs> off. Thank you. Especially not junk. You know, maybe if it's food or clothes or something, but nothing crazy. But, you know, you got to keep in mind who you're talking to. I, st I, I have a, an entire washing machine filled with $5 black t-shirts, you know, so uh, take the advice with a grain of salt. But I'm pretty sure it's good advice. Whoa, turbo boost? What the hell? Is that guy flying? That guy's... That's like... What? Mary Poppins! What? That car has a windshield.
You know what people do <laughs> yeah, when when you. people ask, "Hey, when is Eris gonna play this game?" or "Do you guys know when Eris is streaming?" They'll link a clip, <laughs> yeah, and it you. will be titled "The Schedule," and it's just a clip of me yelling like that. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you. Marimba? What's that? Wow. Girls. All I really want is girls. And in the morning it's girls. I like the way that they walk. That's a classic. Oh, dude, why did it unequip my... Oh! Did he just knock my car over? What the fuck? What the fuck? Oh! Hey! Oh, my. Damn! Hold on. You gotta turn that back over. And the chat room told me that's the noise you make when you see the cops. But I thought that it was hooty hoo, right? That's what I thought. And then just later that same week, I was walking around the block at my old place and I heard these fucking street toughs in the park going hooty hoo. And I realized that it wasn't hooty hoo. It was like, you know, hooty hoo, really loud. And if I hadn't learned from the chat room that that's what that means, then I would have been like, man, why are these street toughs making these weird bird noises? <laughs> Whose hand is that? <laughs> Whose hand is this? It's gotta be me, I'm not gonna save her. I just met her and she's a robot. The park, the whole park, the whole sandworm. I mean, look, you can't I expect much for a DLC. The over us. If they made it a full game, maybe they would have included all those things. But dude, give them a break, dude. What do you expect? $30? That was an amazing purchase. Human Leave this music on. Hey, uh, I don't take musical requests from shitheads. Anyway, thanks, Sway. And Zo, thanks for the 10 gifted subs. That's really nice of you. Thanks, Hal, Mara, and Teeth Big. Appreciate it. Yeah, that's the thing, man. If I go and take that request, then every little cocksucker on the internet's gonna be like, hey, what about play yeah, some yeah, Green yeah. Day? Thank How you. about some 311? Or maybe we can get a couple. What about some uh, Deftones? Yeah, nah, man. Buy a shirt and shut up. Just toasted a frozen quiche. What the fuck is a a quiche? Quiche. <laughs> what the fuck is a quiche? Uh, anyway, yeah, all right. Why was it frozen? I don't know what a f English only pendejo. What the fuck is a quiche? <laughs> Um, uh, I forgot what we were talking about. Anyway, enjoy your quitchy. Hey, watch those hands, bitch. Is this a porn game? <laughs> Better not be. Better not be a porn game. Are you sure? If it's a porn game, then I gotta stop playing it and take the rest of the day off. So I'm thinking it's a porn game Thanks. too. Huh? <laughs> <laughs> mm, to rock, to rock. You did it again. To rock. That is the greatest ending I've ever seen. Okay, let me paint the picture. I opened my Twitter, right? mentions some cocksuckers like hey six hundred dollars a turnip you want to come over to my island i didn't even respond right i didn't even respond i didn't like the tweet 
it's got three comment tweets. Three. So I look at those. I'm scrolling down. It says, hey, any chance I could get on your island? You mind if you give me an invite? Can I get some of those prices? How about let me get one of those? Let me get two of those. That's what a cheater sounds like. Groveling. I got these cheeseburgers, man. And those are the guys that are sending me fucking pictures about, look how sick my island is. Yeah, my island would be sick too if I was sucking dicks for turnips. Yeah, all right, sure. My island would be sick too. Cheating ass bitch. Whoa! I'm pretty sure it's legal. I'm pretty sure it's legal. Because it's on the Twitch directory. That's a, that's a legal nipple. <laughs> Just FYI. My instinct was to remove it from the screen. Oh! Okay, this, this seems safe. Uh, but I don't have to remove it from the screen. This is legal. Look at this asshole. This guy, okay, donated $3, right? That's not enough for your message to be read out loud. But I read it for you. It says, can I get a shout out for my boy Baghead Kid? I already said thanks to him earlier. I don't know what he did, but I said thanks. I remember the name. He says, he's been feeling down recently and could use some love. First thing he needs to do is... <sighs> oh, that took some work holding that in. <sighs> okay. Uh, anyway, I hope you feel better. Uh, and also, it's $4.20 for you to get your dumb fucking message read. I gave you that one for free. Or, I guess, for a discount. A buck 20 off. <laughs> yeah, thank anyway, you. nobody wants to hear that, dude. Are you new? He must be new. Nobody here wants to fucking hear about someone feeling down. You know, let me tell you something. Whoever that guy is who's feeling down, I always say this shit, man. You don't want to get in a bad day competition with anyone. When you get 4,000 people in one place at the same time, someone in this fucking chat room is dying. Or something like that. So you want to have a bad day competition with that fucking guy? No, you don't. Hell no. You know, and that guy is over there not telling everyone. Okay? That fucking trooper is over there enjoying the stream, not telling everyone. Okay, so that's why I don't want to hear about bad news. Because if we're going to start telling each other about bad news, then these motherfuckers are going to come out of the darkness and they're going to... Everybody get down. Unless you want to become an heiress sub. Thanks. Too late now. You're my favorite streamer. You're an heiress sub. It's outrageous. Let's run squads, bro. Sure thing, man. I'm on Xbox. Send me the invite, amigo. Someone get rid of him. Can't do the time. Don't do the crime. We had our fun. I, you know, I don't, why they waited for me to find every pair of titties in that game before they banned me? That is, you know, still unsolved mysteries. You know, I played I, I played that shit like five times, right? And there was a gap where I played other games in between, and they waited for every single one of those puppies to be uncovered, and then, you know, I, look, I'm not asking any questions. Hey, one day, thanks. He farted. <laughs> Uh, I usually don't stream when I have gas. If I have gas, like, nah. No way. I'm not trying to worry about muting the mic. Because sometimes you gotta work to make that shit happen. And sometimes that shit happens without you even knowing. I don't need to be have clips of me and shit. Fuck you. You guys really like talking shit about people that I talk shit about. That shit's pretty funny. It reminds me of, like, um... You know, there's always those characters in movies, like that little gremlin motherfucker that hangs out with Jabba the Hutt and laughs his fucking ass off. You guys are like a bunch of those guys. I just killed Han Solo, put his ass in carbonite. You guys are like, <laughs> just talking shit, looking at Princess Leia's tits. Where's Waldo? Where's Waldo? Okay. This guy's tight. 
That's all he says? The fuck is this? Oh, 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 oh shit, look at that. There's a guy right there. I can't see him though. Yes! Eat that fucking bitch! Ah! Ah! <laughs> Is this guy gonna be the ultimate boss? Look, I was on EDD, I was on unemployment, and I was probably basically you, and I didn't buy a new fucking, any kind of streaming equipment. This motherfucker is green half the time. This is the same unemployment camera I had back in November of 2011, okay? This one I'm fucking pointing at right now. 720p. West side. You see what I'm saying? So, maybe you should just buy food. <laughs> anyway, yeah, Velvet7, let me just teach you something about streaming. It's kind of core etiquette to farm for fans on someone else's stream, especially with a donation message. And especially when you've already got such an advantage, uh, you know, in, the, uh, in a couple of departments. I mean, it's just like, uh, it's, it's low class. And I know what you're thinking. This fat fuck is giving me advice on class? But, yeah, I mean, you know, tough pill to swallow, I guess. But, it's all good. You know, we all grow and learn. Don't forget to tell your mom I said happy Mother's Day. Hold the sword away from the enemy and spin? Why do I want to do that? Why not? Oh, because it... Goes backwards first? Ah, uh, I see. It swings behind you first. Damn, you got a walk-in back turn? Valdo. Ah, that was a shitty idea! Oh, someone banned- I fell off the cliff! Hey, ban that guy! Who said to do that? Someone get rid of that guy. Thank you. This is like... A roller coaster ride because as you can see my friends at Warner Brothers games they heard about what a friendly and open-minded community we have here the heiress community follow my lead <laughs> thank you and so they were like hey you're a really great twitch director we'd love for you to play our aftermath story <laughs> mode <laughs> for you. all of your fans you know? And I was like, well, you heard right. Uh, sounds good. I'm in. Right? And then I got banned <laughs> on the day I'm supposed to do it. So that's why I left so abruptly. Because I was like, well, fuck. I got something I gotta do tomorrow, you know? Hurry up and ban me and let me do my time. Damn, 200 word essay? Give me the treasure. Oh my god. God. Take notes. Oh, oh no. Damn. I'm going to say yes. <laughs> oh, yes. Should I say yes? <laughs> Thank you. Look for question marks. Oh. <laughs> Thank you. Yeah. Shout out to the ones who have lost their mom's big love. What a terrible donation message. Anyway, thanks Steve Otron and ATL Zen. That was such a shitty fucking message. It's crazy. 
I mean, I'm over here appreciating good moms, making people smile, and this little cocksucker says that shit and then brings out all the sad faces. You don't know the first thing about making people smile, man. Yeah, there's a lot of sh sad shit we could shout out, dude. Come on, you trying to shout out sad shit? Shout out to sad shit. Shouts out to mental illness. Come on, dude. The whistles got whip. Crash my whip into wide own businesses. Has a battle royale mode. It's tight. You know, my not delicious. Hey, this game's tight. No wonder everybody likes this shit. I always, honestly, man. Zelda fans really give the games a bad reputation. You would think if a game is good, the fans would also be good, you know? But that's not the case. Not the case at all. Zelda community, toxic, homophobic, racist, I mean, you name it. And they, they share a lot with the Metal Gear community, okay? I'm just saying, I've noticed that. The community does not reflect the quality of the game. Metal Gear fans also. It's very true. That's such a fucking sweet feature. Like, you know those guys who say... Like, right now, a minute ago, during the break, some guy said, ay ay a bunch of times, right? And then he got parried by someone, and that guy said, <laughs> yeah, Shut you. up, bitch. <laughs> I mean, that was sweet. That was sweet. <laughs> you know? Well, you've been competing in the Mario Kart North. Hey, all right. Thanks very much, Rangus. Shut up, bitch. That was sweet. Just walk the floor is invisible. Okay, I tell you what. Here's what I'm going to do. I'm going to ban you. Okay, now you're banned. Then I'm going to walk. Oh, wait. Oh, shit. I just banned that guy. Get fucking banned, pussy! I can't believe it worked! Marvel fans always were the most, like, absurdly rowdy. You know, they were just really rowdy. Marvel, Marvel. You know? They were really rowdy. And this guy at EVO, he had a seizure in the crowd during Marvel Grand Finals. One of the early years. He had a seizure, a real one. And the people around him just thought he was getting hype about Marvel. Yeah, Marvel! So they would like see him and they're like, yeah, Marvel! Get hype! Oh man, that reminds me. I'm getting job offers from VPNs now. I don't know if that's a good thing or a sign of success, but I'm getting VPN job offers. <laughs> and let me tell you, you, I'm thinking of taking them. Start banning people and then giving them my code. Heat wave with no ease, bitch. Get that VPN if you want to participate, motherfucker. From my perspective, I sit here all day and collect money for no fucking reason. So I have to. It's like an obligation to do that. You know? It's like a... I have to. It's part of my luck build, you know? I have to do that for my luck build to work. It's like a circular ching chang sign, you know, harmonious. <laughs> Woo! Woo! That game was awesome. What a good game. That game was the pyramids. That game was the pyramids. I don't know how the fuck humans could have possibly made this game in 1992 when they're making bullshit garbage in 2020. I mean, it's the pyramids. It's not possible. There, There is no explanation. How did they build this game without anything? In 1992. Death Stranding. I mean, stinking shitty. F you name it. You name it, there are so many garbage games that are coming out fucking 18 years. How many years? Tw 28? 28, dude? Oh yeah, the VODs, of course, all the VODs are gonna be... I mean, I'm not gonna go through and just take out all the parts with pornos. The VODs are all deleted. Just consider yourself lucky if you were a part of that playthrough. It was a moment in history, you know? We changed the rules, or we bent them until they kind of were bent out of shape. 
That was way, way, way better than any gaming show, any E3, any anything they've ever done that was Thank way you. better because it didn't have a host, it didn't have a bunch of fucking influencers sitting around, uh, you know, sending you over to Carol who's live at the fucking press release. It didn't have any of that. Fast. Next one. This game sucks. This game sucks. Next game. This game's trash. Next game. I loved it. I can't wait for The Last of Us 2 shit talk tomorrow. Me too. I'm really excited. I'm not I'm not as excited about the game itself as I am about streaming it and making fun of it. I'm planning on riding both sides of the fence here and whenever someone annoying really likes the game, I'm going to talk shit about them and whenever someone really annoying doesn't like the game, I'm going to talk shit about them too. So I'm going to be all over the place. People are going to be pissed. It's going to be tight. It's like a sneak preview. Next time on Dragon Ball Fighter Z. Use left stick to choose a chord. <laughs> that is so... Touch pad swipe vertical. <sighs> swipe to strong. You guys should be shaking in your fucking boots, dude. Amazing. This game sucks. <laughs> what the fuck? This is how you're gonna introduce the player. First, you're gonna ride a horse for five seconds, and then you're gonna do this. So rude. Yeah, I know, man. I the the real truth is, I try to be as rude as possible because I have way too many fans in here, and I don't like that. So I'm trying to downsize. I got a lot of Ares fans, there's a lot of them, and they're already hard enough to deal with. So anytime I get new people in here, I try and get, get them to fuck off and not come back. At least for a few years. You know what I mean? Round two. But it's not easy. They You just can't get rid of them. They're like flies on shit. For lack of a better analogy, I guess. Maybe. Do you think that love can bloom even on the battlefield? <laughs> He's asking that question intentionally. Because it's a like it's designed to be stupid, you know? And he's making fun of you, the last guy. And the reason he's doing that is because he knows that I don't like questions. So he's kind of like, uh, you know, do you like sharks? And here they come. Here they come. Who's the tallest guy you've ever met? Yeah, this is really common around here. Uh, trust me. I know what I'm talking about. Uh, Ares fans are very predictable. This is a very common thing. They see an opportunity to regurgitate the same thing and make themselves look like assholes, and then they happily do it even though they know it's gonna happen. It's really weird. But the cool thing about it is that at the end of the day, they're giving me dollar dues because they like me, so I thank them. But really, it's pathetic. <laughs> okay, keep it together. Four point game. Get the ball from this fucking cocksucker! Yeah, no! Oh, fuck. Yes! There's like no fouls! Uh-oh. Woo. Gameplay. That's so disappointing. Could you imagine? Think about how the disparity there. Look at this game's graphics. Look at her hair and the grass and the rust. And look at the game play decision making. Right here. Look at the thing in the middle of the screen. This is like some... Sega Genesis level game design and then look at the level of what you can see visually the the way it's advanced it doesn't even make sense this is like yeah Suzuki level Dreamcast game design or earlier PS1 PS2 but then look at the graphics everything has advanced except for the gameplay it's ridiculous. It's disappointing that this is the kind of shit I'm doing in a game that looks like this. Never gotten killed by those guys before. Those frogs. Unwanted sexual advances? That's a boy! What? That's a boy frog!
You know what game I really liked was the... Whoa! Be cool. <laughs> oh, man. Life flashed before my eyes there. No need to be cautious. Oh, no! Oh, my God! That's done. He stole $25,000, dude. And it was the same guy from the diamond. You again? <laughs> yeah, dude, I do remember you. Where are the fucking police? Jeez. Uh, yeah, that seems familiar. Give me a four year sub patch now. Hey, thanks, demanding ass bitch. All right, look, I'm working on it. I got two ideas and one other idea and two other ideas. So I got all these ideas, okay? I'm working on all of those things. Now keep in mind, when I tell people I'm working on it, that means fuck off. It's done. Come play. <laughs> yeah, it's really you. good. The netcode's better than everything else you're playing right now, probably, unless you're playing MK or Skullgirls or whatever. So yeah, just give it a <laughs> you. All you need is a or whatever. To learn with. Damn, MK Skullgirls or whatever. Them's hype. Like, them's fighting words is them. whatever, dude. Sure. He doesn't even remember that last one. Them's fighting hurts is whatever. Oh, damn, the ultimate trash talk. Dude, you got the maker of Killer Instinct talking shit about you. That's rough. Ouch. You know how many people say whatever about Killer Instinct? Dude, fucking Keats. That was the best part right there at the end. Thank you. The best part at the end. It's way better than all the other games you're playing online, except for <laughs> Mortal Kombat. <laughs> and whatever that last trash is called. You know, these kinds of games, they're low budget. They're designed by a studio that maybe they didn't have the time or resources to do the type of testing that needs to be done, quality assurance. So I'm happy to do that for free, you know? More than happy. <laughs> I wonder how we could Oh! Oh! Did you see her leg? Oh! I ate shrooms! I ate shrooms! My girlfriend's head's twisting all the way around. Holy shit, dude. Pre clickers bark to a chalicate. If you stand in front of their bark, what did she say? Square button. Clickers bark to a chalicate. If you stand in front of their bark, they will see you. What are you, an ESL? That's echolocate. <laughs> E-chocolate. <laughs> Fuck. E-chocolate? Square button clickers bark to e-chocolate. If you stand in front of their bark, they will see you. X button. Continue. L1 button. Previous. R1 button. Your switchblade is ineffective against clickers during combat. You all right. Look in case you guys missed it, earlier today, before I started streaming, 30 minutes before I started streaming, some generous stoner donated $100 while I wasn't streaming. And his message was, that guy's a bitch. <laughs> and I suspect the reason that happened is he was watching a VOD and he thought the VOD was live. <laughs> I'm not sure that that's the case, but I think it is. And he later came back and donated more, and he would not confirm or deny. He was, man, he's like a sculptor. Because the first time he put the tooth in, it was all wrong. I was like, man, they made this tooth all wrong. This isn't even my tooth. He's like, just be patient, man. I got to make it fit. So then he like... You know, he did all this fine tuning. It's like he's, he's he put the Michelangelo's David in my mouth. Nothing sexual. If I flush it now, dude, no pants is gonna jump off a bridge, dude. You know that? 
he already started putting the playthrough on YouTube. And he has a rule where he doesn't put playthroughs on YouTube if I don't finish them. So, if I stop this game, No Pants literally is not going to be having a good day. Which, now that I'm verbalizing it, I gotta say, I am starting to get sick of this game. <laughs> He's grinding his teeth right now. He's watching an anime, and he has my stream on on the side, and he heard that shit, and he's grinding. Don't worry, dude. I got this. We're almost done anyway, right? Man. You know, me and that guy go way back, man. I crashed my other friend's car into the woods. <laughs> With him in the back seat while he was reading a Maxim. And he didn't even notice it. He was so distracted by those titties. He's reading his Maxim. And I'm like crashing the car through the woods, off the freeway into a ditch. Thank you. And my friend David, I'm not David, Dan, uh, it's his car. And he's screaming like a girl at the top of his lungs. I'm crashing. And Rich is just reading, looking at a Maxim magazine. That's true. That really happened. And I didn't hit anything. Dodged everything. I just drove into the woods. Dodging trees and shit. Because it was raining, you know? And these damn Camrys. Ah. The last thing you asked before you got banned. First of all, let me make this clear. At 1719. Why did you shoot me, mods? Double question mark, sad face. At 720, once I began questioning him. No. Second comment, no I didn't. And that's a response to me saying you probably asked a question. Then we go back to 1709, the scene of the crime. And here I can see, at avoiding the puddle, are you going to play Dark Souls anytime soon? Double question mark. Hmm, a calling card. Look at that double question mark. The double question mark. Bandit bitch. Hmm. Case closed. My favorite mustard is silver spring jalapeno mustard. It's fucking good. You will never <laughs> eat jealous. yellow mustard again. Regular yellow mustard truly becomes garbage after silver spring. They give it a nozzle hole that's wide so it can poop out those chunks of jalapeno. It's good. Mm, anyway, mm, I also like uh, Sweet Hot. Have you ever tried Sweet Hot mustard? Sweet Hot. Mustard is gross. Yeah, all right. Well, fuck you. That means we're not talking to you. Grown-ups are talking. Why don't you go to your room and play some Fortnite, you little cocksucker? The grown-ups are talking. Super Mario Maker? Nah, that, the concept of that game really grosses me out. There's something about how... You know, people will create a stage, and I could just imagine, like, them creating a stage and then jerking off to their favorite streamer, being frustrated with it being challenging, and nah. The whole idea feels really gross to me. I don't want to play your perverted stage. Fuck you. Did you like it? No. If you mean this game, no. It was probably the hardest I've worked in years beating this game. This has been the most manual labor I've done in multiple years. And if you even think about buying it, you're going to get fucking jumped. <laughs> Not only Thank am you. I saying don't buy it, but if you even think about buying it, me and the rest of these Ares fans are going to find you. Beat your ass. Don't buy it. Anyway, we were getting pizza. Me and my mom. I must. I was a little kid. And we were getting pizza. And she wanted her favorite pizza, right? And I wanted my favorite pizza, right? And she said, if you let me get my favorite pizza, I'll rent you a video game. And she didn't know that I really loved her favorite pizza, too. 
So I was like, this is a great opportunity. And I was like, two video games. <laughs> and she said, deal. And that pizza was hella fucking good. It was good. I'll never forget it. It was round table. But look, here's the problem. Donatello is a fucking nerd. And Raphael is an emo little cocksucker. Michelangelo is the best. He's the best one. He doesn't give a fuck about <laughs> anything. You. Computers, honor, like fucking Leo. He doesn't give a fuck about <laughs> anything but Thank pizza you. and skateboarding and April O'Neil's cooch and teats. And that's it. That's why I like him. He doesn't give a fuck. Leo's got too much honor. And Raphael fucks everything up, dude. He might as well work at Hot Topic. He's a little bitch. He fucks everything up. And Donatello, you know, he's a nerd. But he's cool, though. I think he's my second favorite. Thank you. Hey, you know streaming's tight. It really is. <laughs> I've always you. thought it's been so tight. I fucking love it. I still do after all this time. I really do. It's so fun. Uh, and regardless of what you're doing, as long as you can make fun out of it. Because, I mean, think about how shitty this was. But every day I was excited, including today, the last day. I was excited to stream today. I was like, man, this is gonna be tight. You know how many people are gonna tell me to flush this game? Can't wait to ruin their week, fucking cocksuckers.